Hello everyone. It's flipping crazy. I would like to welcome you to my first pop-up sale here on YouTube. The sale will be just rings. Many are marked 925 but they're not tested so I'm going to sell them all as fashion rings. Um, I may have to do more than one video because I have almost 80 rings to post. Um, all the rings will be five dollars each. Shipping will be four dollars flat ship if you buy one or you buy 20 or you buy 50 and it's also for sh shipping within the US only for this sale. Um, the way this works is I'm gonna put up a ring and I'm gonna put up the ring number and then when the video is done and you watch the video you can comment on the numbers of the rings that you want. Um, please do not edit your comments because that will mess things up and say you wanted number four and then you wanted number seven later on. Don't edit your comment to say you want number seven also. Make a new comment for that second ring that you want. Um, I will need you to email me at I'm too flipping crazy at gmail.com and I will have the spelling to that in the description of this video. I will need you to send me your YouTube name, your real name, and your PayPal email so I can send you an invoice. Like I said, this may be two or three videos for the rings. Um, I'll probably wait to check everybody's orders completely by the time the last video happens and then within that day or two I will invoice everybody and you will have 48 hours to pay from the time you get your invoice. So let's get started. This is ring number one it is approximately a size 8. I say approximately because they could be off by a little bit higher or a little bit lower. And if you look at the dot on the number for this, for the ring number one, that means it is Mark 925, but like I said, none of these rings are tested, so they are all being sold as fashion rings. This is a pretty pink stone ring in the shape of a heart, size 8. Again, this is ring number one. Next up, ring number two, size seven. It's a pretty blue ring. And again, the shipping is a flat $4, no matter how many rings you purchase. And this is within the United States only, this sale. Okay, that's ring number two. Next up, ring number three. It's approximately a size seven three quarters to an eight.
I would say this is a peach color ring, peach color stone. And again, whenever you see that dot under the ring's number, that means it is marked 925 but is not tested, so all rings are being sold as fashion only. Let that one come around again. That is ring number three. This is ring number four, approximately size seven and a half. Pretty purple ring. Excuse me. And again, that is ring number four. Next up, ring number five, approximately size eight. I don't know if you can hear that in the background, but it is pouring rain here. This is a gold tone ring, a pale gold tone ring, not a gold gold, real bright gold, um, with purple. Very pretty ring. I'll let it come around one more time. Okay, again, ring number five. Next up, it 
is ring number six, size seven approximate. This one's pink, silver tone. Okay, ring number six, size seven. Next up, a blue ring, silver tone, ring number seven, approximately size eight. trying to find a nice way to show you these rings uh, the clearest way possible, the lightest way possible, the most unobstructed way possible. I do find it difficult on some videos that I see where the lighting's too dark or the rings are held too far away or the fingers holding the rings are blocking some of the view of the settings of the ring or the shoulders of the ring. Um, I think this is a good way for you to get that 360 view of the entire ring without anything in the way and trying to show as much detail as I can this way. I hope you like looking at them like this. Okay, again, ring number seven, size eight. I'm just trying to show them as I would like to see them when I'm shopping for the jewelry. Okay, with this one. And this is ring number eight, approximately size six and a half. Some of you may see things that the people have for sale and then you get it and it looks close to what you thought it would look like but not totally what you thought it would look like. So I'm trying to leave no questions on any of the features of these rings. I want you to know exactly what you're getting. It's a nice pale yellow color. Again, ring number eight.
Next up, ring number nine, approximately size six. This one has nice green stones, and the ring is gold tone. And I want to thank everybody that's watching this for watching my very first pop-up video on YouTube for my first pop-up sale. <clears throat> Excuse me. Size six, ring number nine. Next up is ring number ten, approximate size eight and a half to eight and three quarters. This is a black stone, gold tone ring. If you like this way of having jewelry set up to buy it from a pop-up, let me know in the comments. I'm thinking of also doing a pin pop-up sale the same way. And possibly earrings. Okay, that was ring number 10. Next up, ring number 11, approximate size 5 and 3 quarters to 6. And this is gold tone with red stones. I'm sorry if I keep forgetting to tell you if it's gold tone or silver tone or what color stones are in it. Okay, that was ring 11. Next 
next up. Ring 12, approximately size 7. This is a pretty color green. Silver tone ring. Gorgeous. Love that one. Okay, ring number 12. Next up, ring number 13. Approximate size 7 and 3 quarters. Gold tone ring with purple stone. Excuse me. Okay, that was ring 13. Next, a pretty blue ring, blue stone, silver tone ring, ring number 14, approximate size seven and a half. I think it takes a bit long for this to go full circle twice for each ring. I may just, the next part to this video, the next batch of rings, I may only have it go one time around for each ring, not twice. I think I'm going to cut down a little on these here for the sake of time. Okay, so that is ring number 14. This is ring number 15, approximately size six and a quarter, pink ring. silver tone ring and it doesn't want to stay up straight
<coughs> excuse me. Again, that is ring number 15. Next, ring number 16, approximately size seven and a half. This one I'm only gonna have it go around once, so once you see the back of it, I'm gonna take this one off. Okay, ring number 16. This is ring number 17, approximately size six and a half. Silver tone ring with a green stone. Okay, that was ring 17. Ring number 18, approximately size six and a half. Silver tone, it sort of looks like a topaz color, I would say. Okay, that one was ring number 18. This one, ring number 19, approximately size 7.
Okay. That was ring number 19. This ring number 20, approximately size 8. Gold tone ring. Purple stones. All right, ring number 20. Ring number 21, approximately size six and a half, silver tone ring with a black stone. That's just the red reflecting from my record light on my phone, on my camera, sorry. It is a black stone. Okay, again, ring 21. Next is ring 22, approximately size 8. I made the rings all the same price. It's a lot easier this way. I know some of these I could have gotten a lot more than $5 a piece for, but it's just easier just to do a pop-up with one price point and trying to give everybody a deal. I could have probably got more if I auctioned some of them, but I just wanted to see how they would go this way. Okay, again, that one is ring number 22. Next up. Ring number 23, approximately size 8. Very pretty color blue stone, a uh, silver tone ring. I think at the most I'm going to try to get to 30 rings in this video. Okay, so 
That is ring number 23. This one is ring number 24, approximately size six and a half. This is a silver tone ring with red stones. And I think once you see the back of this, I will go on to the next ring. So I can try to get 30 rings into this at least. And I have a cat crying at my door wanting to come in here. He's going to start picking at the door any moment. You probably hear him crying. Okay, ring 24. Next up, ring 25, approximately size 8. This one has a sort of brownish stone in the middle. Just come around again. This video is running a bit long, so I'm not going to give these as much time as I was. Okay, so that is ring number 25. This is ring number 26, approximately size six and a half. Gold tone ring with pink stones. Once this goes past the sideways mark, I'm going to take it down to try to get some more of these in quicker. Okay, that was ring number 26. I apologize for my fingers looking bad, my cuticles and my fingernails. I've been working on my car and doing yard work so I don't keep nails that long and then my cuticles end up getting getting ripped too so this is ring number 27 approximately size 7 pretty blue stone in the center Okay, again, ring number 27. This is ring number 28, approximate size five and three quarters. Not too sure what this stone is. Okay, 
once you see the back I'm going to take it down see the back is open okay that was ring 28 Next up, ring number 29, approximately size 8. Pretty blue stone, silver tone ring. All right, that side, that was ring number twenty nine. Next one is ring number thirty, approximately size six and a quarter, silver tone ring. With purple stones. Okay, ring number 30. <coughs> Excuse me. Next up, ring number 31, approximately size 7. This is uh, green stones and that gunmetal type finish. I'll let it go to the back, showing the back of the ring, and then I'm going to move on. Okay. That was ring number 31. Next up, ring number 32, approximately size 6.5. Pink stones and the ring is silver tone. I'm going to wait a little bit till it shows the back. All right, there it is. Again, ring number 32. Next up, ring number 33, approximately size 8. This again looks like a peachy color stone.
Okay, that was ring number 33. Next up, ring number 34, approximately size 5, gold tone ring with a black stone. Okay, that was ring number 34. Next up, ring number 35, approximately size 7 and 3 quarters. Okay, show a little bit of it again here. Okay, that was ring 35. Next up, ring number 36, approximately size 7 silver tone ring with a purple stone. Okay, that was ring 36. Next up, ring number 37, approximate size 6 to 6 and a quarter. Uh, pretty blue ring with that gunmetal sort of finish. I think this is going to be the last video, the last ring for this video. And I will try to record the second part tonight if my camera charges in time. Okay, there you go. And that was ring number 37. Okay, everyone, uh, be ready for part two, either coming up tonight or tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed watching the pop-up, and I look forward to seeing your comments. And always remember to like if you like the video, subscribe if you already haven't done so already, and hit that bell for notifications each time I put up a video. Bye, see you for part two.